least exciting guests. No, but yeah, pretty much. Just kidding. <laughs> no, you can we, be fast if you want. No, it's okay. I appreciate you guys. Well, yeah, I mean, today, digital keeps getting passed over for network. Not that I'm yeah. tattletailing, but that's why I appreciate you guys stopping. 100%. We so love it. Thank you yeah, so course. much. Um, you guys have some big stars in this movie. We do. But I know that you guys worked on the Switch, so you already had it in pretty good with uh, Jen Aniston and yes, Jason we had their We had their cell phone number, so they couldn't not pick up the phone when we called. So how do you get them a script and convince them to do another one with you guys? They must have liked you if they're going around soon, right? Yeah. I think, I think, no, we had such a great time making the switch. So when we were casting this movie, you know, we kind of tailored two of these roles for them. And uh, luckily they said yes. That was great. So there also are really annoying bosses in the movie that I saw in the trailer. And you don't have to name names. But on any of your sets, can you name one thing that a star made their assistant do? But you're not naming names, so... You can be like, one day we were on set and I have something. I have something. And when you're in Atlanta, okay. which is um, the South, yeah. and an actress asks her assistant to find a salted bagel <laughs> like they have in New York City, um, which is not an easy thing to do in Atlanta. There's not a lot of I'm Jewish. From Florida, so yeah, I there's know. not a lot of Jewish delis in uh, the greater Atlanta area. Yeah. So it was not that easy. Was and I think it was like 6.30 in the evening. Yeah. So. so you have an actress that eats carbs? I'm not saying if it's an actress or an actor, oh, yes. but oh. a thespian of some but sort. You yes. don't keep them on the no carb diet. You're like embracing them with the non body. No, thing. it's even worse yeah. than that. It's the perfect Hollywood story because they asked for the salted bagel to show us what a salted bagel was like, but then didn't actually eat it. So, so take it to how you two guys met because you worked together a lot. So yeah. how did that happen in film school? Yeah, we, we, it up? we met in uh, at NYU Film School, which is a very unique I experience. Wish I wish I had a mascot so I could say go uh, the violets, bobcats, right? No, the, the violets, 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 like violets. a flower. Like a, yeah, but because it's purple. No, it's the violets. Bobcats. No, I just looked it up. Did you? Yeah. Recently? Yeah. It's the NYU. Bobcats. Bobcats. It's I the least it the New Violets. York mascot you could possibly have. That is have. weird. Do you guys bicker like this when watching the dailies? Yes. No, because normally what happens is we'll have our fight, then in front of you or an actor, we'll right. say, it's the Bobcats. Right. So we, how, if I'm the actress, when you guys are directing, are you just sitting like this, or you're like on the edge? What kind of, are you hovering directly? I'm usually like this. Yeah, he's got a migraine. What's the best part of directing such a big feature, and what's the most frustrating part? The best part is it's just movies are great and they live forever and when you get to see an audience, especially with a comedy, enjoy a movie, there's nothing like it. And the hardest part, I think, ah... Uh, lack of sleep? Yeah. I'm too tired to answer, so probably lack of sleep, yeah. So last question, because yeah. I'm a little sad, but I feel like everything comes in timing. I was really hoping to meet Jennifer Aniston today. But she's like a girl crush girl. I feel like I get why people cast her. Yeah. Girls like her. Yeah. Yeah. She seems really nice. So any good Jen, Jen yeah. stories? Just that we love her. I mean, she's a good friend of ours, and she's the most normal person you've ever met. Um, I think what you see is what you get. That yeah. character is really a transparent uh, part of her. And what was fun about the movie is... You know, she likes to play outside of her comfort zone, and she's really brave as an actress with everything from horrible bosses to cake. And so for us she's having such made... She's a nice yeah. person. She oddly plays mean very well. Yes, she funny. does. Quirky as well. She's yes, really good. She That's is. why people like her. Yeah. Do you always carry your Leica around? I do. This is my... I want to document this experience. Just in case you don't photograph it well, he <laughs> wants to reshoot it. Yeah, so... All right, and anything else you guys are working on next or just doing all promos for... I think we're just focused on getting as many people to see Office Christmas Party as possible, not just because fire? we have anything in us, but because it might be a fire alarm. Because the building, yeah, the building's going down, so if we don't get people to go see it before the building lights on fire, no, uh, December 9th, that's all we're focused on. Because we really are proud of the movie, and the cast is so great in it, and that's what we want to do. So, yeah. well, Congratulations, guys. Thanks it's so kind much. of a big, I did NYU Student Films when I was at Hunter College. Oh, cool. So Hunter's it's exciting. Yeah. Well, yeah. No. no. It I is. can't name one director from Hunter, can you? Um, no, but I know <laughs> a little bit about the film program, because I do know some people who have gone there, and they're Vin really Diesel good. Went there. Well, there you go. That's the person. Yeah, Dom Toretto. Come on. Yeah, exactly. Thanks. Thanks, guys. Okay, yeah, thanks. Thank you so much.